Hello guys, this is Sam's Tech Help with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to update your PS3 with a flash drive, a USB flash drive. So how you're going to do this is first of all go to PlayStation.com and when this does load I'll show you another set of instructions. Sorry about the loading speeds, it was very slow during this video, I am not sure why. Okay, so when it does actually load, please scroll down all the way to the bottom and you should see the latest update. Do press on that, and when you do, it will bring up another window. There's actually a lot of windows involved in this. I'm not sure why PlayStation picked it like that. Alright, so you're going to have to press on Download Now in the middle of the page. So when you do press on this, another window comes up which you'll finally download the actual update so when you do get to this window you're just gonna scroll down and download so this will actually download the actual update which will take about half an hour not even and then there it is so let me pop out of this window and take the actual pr proprietary software onto my flash drive my flash drive is called SAM so when I do get to my flash drive you're going to have to make a new folder called PS3 but as you can see you have to wait a little bit for it to actually load so while this is loading I wanted to talk about something I am going to have future gameplay on my gaming channel well this is my gaming channel slash tech channel and well right now I'm checking out software that will work with the Hapage. I have tried out one software but it doesn't look as good as it actually is so it keeps on cutting out and it's only about 720p I actually want it 1080p because my viewers love HD gaming alright so give it a second to download sorry about that yeah it takes a little bit for it to actually copy onto your flash drive I'm not sure it's, if it's just for me, but yeah. Alright, so when this does happen, as I said, you have to make a new folder called PS3, all in uppercase letters. So when you do do this, you have to take the actual proprietary software and put it onto that folder. And then again, make another folder, which is called Update. And this is just for it to recognize the actual software. Alright, let's go to my PS3, guys. Meet you there. Alright, so when you do get to your PS3, what you guys are going to have to do is go to Settings and System Update. And then another window will pop up and it will say Update via Internet or Update via Storage Media. Please pick Storage Media. So this just recognizes the update and you should update. Please subscribe, like, and yes, this was a voiceover. 